All right, we're hoping those clouds mm -hmm. stay away for at least part of this week because there's a pretty cool event going on in the sky in the early hours of Wednesday morning. Yeah, Krem 2's Evan Narani is in the studio right now talking about a super blue blood moon eclipse. Evan? Right, yeah, a lot going on, right? So super blue blood moon, kind of a mouthful. So we're going to break down this rare lunar trilogy piece by piece. So we all know what a super moon is at this point, right? This is the third one that we've had this month. Basically, it's when the full moon is closest to the Earth in its orbit, making it look bigger and brighter than normal. So what about the blue? Well, this will be our second full moon of January. The last one was on the 1st of January. So when we see two full moons in one month, the second is called a blue moon, which happens every two to three years. Still with me? Okay, so now we've got the super blue. So what about the blood? Well, that same night, we'll also see a lunar eclipse. The lunar eclipse occurs when the Earth's shadow blocks the sun and its light, making the moon look red. Plus, this will be a total lunar eclipse, more dramatic than the usual partial eclipse. So there you have it. A super blue blood moon is what happens when a super moon, a blue moon, and a lunar eclipse all happen at the same time. And as you might have guessed, it's pretty rare phenomenon. Last time it happened was back in 1866. A little history for you. Andrew Johnson was serving as president after President Abraham Lincoln was assassinated. So this is a once in a lifetime event, pretty safe to say, but for the best view of the eclipse, you'll want to look outside in the sky just around 2.50 in the morning on Wednesday morning. So with that, I will send it back to you guys. Wow, good <laughs> explainer. Thank you, Evan. thank you. <laughs> President Lincoln. Is, yeah, that's the and last time it occurred. Uh, so, so we have to set our alarms, don't we? Well, or, I think well so. actually, you should tell us if well, we should. Well, yeah, and here's the deal, gang. We're really on the cusp. You saw that computer model. It'll yeah. be partly cloudy. We may have cloud cover. We may not. We're like, if you really want to see it, you have to head out to central Washington. We're going to keep our fingers crossed. By the way, NASA will be live streaming the event. Okay, so we can watch that. Yeah. Thanks, Tom.